Hey, how's it going, guys? It's Mad Knife Junkie 13. Uh, this is a add-on plus some goodies I have, some new toys and old toys. This was the uh, first bread I had. I made the camo stand for it. I showed this in an earlier video, but some of my new subs I figured I'd show you guys. You could take it apart like a regular gun, pull the slide back, push the button on the other side, flip this little switch. Oh. Uh -oh comes off, clean it, you can take the spring off, the barrel out, the whole barrel comes out, put it in, flip this up, you're good to go. I took parts out of that so, you know, the hammer and everything doesn't really work perfectly. Uh, also, as I'm showing this, this is my wrist rocket knife text, it's funny you showed this, I was actually shooting this the other day, I had my marble ammo out. Um, it's a Barnett Black Widow. It's a great wrist rocket. Um, if you have medium sized hands, it's perfect. Uh, Tex, you got like extra large. I don't think you'd fit perfectly on this. But real nice wrist rocket. It's never failed me. Very accurate. And I really like it. It comes with this with some uh, steel, steel balls. Um, this is the new toy I got. It's one of those um, lasers that burn shit. So. If you don't put a little sharpie on whatever you're trying to do, if it's not black, it doesn't really burn that great. But let's see if I can get this. i got to hold it really still. It's really bright, too. Sorry, I'm trying to line this up without staring at it. It's smoking, it's just I'm trying not to stare at it. Let me focus the beam out a little more. Sorry guys, I'm trying not to stare at this thing. And what is going on? I'm telling you guys, this thing lights all the time here. Let's try this. Maybe I could steady it better. It's crazy, I, burnt, I was burning stuff all day yesterday with it, as soon as I go to show you guys. Don't want to burn. Yeah, I was, where is it, I was lighting fuse wire with it, a bunch of stuff. I color the whole tip in, so it's easier, I don't have to stare at it as much, my eyes are going all wonky. All right. My hands are so shaky doing this. All right, guys, I'm going to put it down right on the table here. There we go. Man, I'm sorry. I'm trying to show you guys, but it's blind to me and shit. Uh, you guys, I know you guys trust me. There's some people that don't. This is uh, all the way focused out, and you tighten the beam in. And this thing shoots so far. You could see the beam, too, at night. You could see the beam here. Ready? At night, that beam is really bright. Um, you could hit stars and shit with this. It's crazy. Uh, key, shut it off. Also, I wanted to show you guys, um, since I was talking about it, this was at, uh, this is at Godfather. There's me at the front of the line. That's one of my buddy Jason. There's me again. I'm in, uh, this is screenshots from one of their videos. We played um, Cobra's Revenge. And I'm in the, the video a few times. This was our team that day. That's my buddy George and his son. There's me again. There's me again. There's uh, me, George, and his friend. What was his friend's name? Jose, I think. He's a real cool dude, though. He doesn't play with us that much. And this was us at Bad Blood. This was our little squad we showed up with. 
uh, but we had like 40 people on or something like that on the team. Uh, also, if you guys are interested, I don't know if you would be, but if you're trying to check out, I'm just turning the fan on, trying to check out some airsoft, I just rewatched the video. It's Cobra's Revenge uh, Airsoft GI. I'm in the video at 30 seconds, a minute 40, four minutes, uh, and three seconds. Me and this guy are taking the castle down, so we're getting the flag, capture the flag. And right at the end at 450, you'll hear me, uh, we won the last battle I'm on the Joe's team. And uh, this guy is like, Joe's! And, and uh, you just hear me go, yeah! <laughs> it's, uh, I thought it was pretty funny. Um, and then you'll see my buddy George, he's a tank, he's humongous. You'll see him at 2 minutes and 16 seconds, he's got his gas mask that day. And uh, 3 minutes and 40 seconds, and a couple other times, he's just massive dude, beast. You see him cruising through. He just walks, he never runs, he's just, he's a monster. People are always so scared when he's just coming through with that gas mask on. Um, and also, in that video, I completely forgot until I watched the video, this guy's charging me. It's right after, I think it's like... It's right after like 140 or something, or you see me shooting by myself, or it's at, after 30 seconds you see me shooting by myself. This guy's running uh, to get me and my friend, and I shoot him, and he tries to stop real fast because he got shot, and he slips in the mud and falls straight on his back. So if you guys are trying to see what Airsoft's all about, and you're trying to see something where I'm actually in it, and uh, there's some funny clips in it, Check out uh, Airsoft GI, Cobra's Revenge is the game we played, and that's the title of it, Airsoft GI, Cobra's Revenge. Yeah, a bunch of other games we played, uh, the zombie game, we played hooligans, zombie hooligans, we played, another one was like soccer, it was uh, when the World Cup was going on, it was like two different teams, soccer teams, but we were all dressed in camos, so I don't, it didn't make sense. We had to like kick a ball from downtown to uptown, it was, it was crazy. Uh, tons of other games there, you may see me in a few of them, but that one I'm featured in like a lot because I was doing really good that day so the guy that was filming was you know focused on me and my group of buddies uh, you'll see my friend in the very beginning he's just beasting it he's got his AR-15 in one hand his pistol in the other he's just taking people out left and right but check it out if you guys do let me know what you think I'd appreciate it uh, also let me know what you think about this video I don't know what happened with that laser pointer I don't know if it's because the wind or what but that thing burns through everything it burns through electrical tape it burns through <laughs> Anything that's black, if you have something that's not black, like, like this paper plate, you draw on it with a sharpie, it'll burn right through it. Plastic bottles, I think I still have that bottle I was burning yesterday. Yeah, I was burning this bottle yesterday, all along here. So, it's cool, man. Uh, it was from the same site I get my clone knives from, it was real cheap, like 25 bucks. But that's it, guys, if you have any questions, let me know, I hope you have a great day, and, uh... Yeah, that's it. Take care.